And so, we should prepare, because the fight up there is slightly, well, it's difficult. It would be a nice uh, idea to have everyone in, the, in a perfect ready. condition. And in a situation where we have so many of, the, the, of these potions, there is actually no point in... Uh, in, in preserving them in any way. Right, that's more like it. What is my task? Now, I want this to be a quick fight, which means we need to cast spells quite quickly. Uh, now, Imwen, you do have ta uh, improved alacrity. And yes. Edwin, you that you have that too. Right. So let's go oh, with honor. spells first. Uh, images. Yep. There's no point in actually casting. Oh, stone skin is already on us. So what maybe is some it protections. Now? Um, your this your protection from fear. Mirror image what again. Him on fire. Fiery else. thingy, whatever you want to call it. Fire. Improved invisibility on yourself, Edwin. Uh, one on M1, please. Minor globe on the vulnerability. I don't think that will do. Now, Edwin is already yes, yes, I under see. invisibility. Let's cast it again. And hope that there will be no problems. With extra magical energy. On, let's say, Corgan, main you character, require? you fire shield, protection from normal weapons. I should eliminate that one because I don't actually do much. Positive, if you know what I mean. True side, that's, that we will cast that one upstairs. Resist fear, we already have Major that one. Okay. Him, oh, yeah. These protections, they are important. For our fighters, actually, or here, here. Oh, he's under invisibility. So, protection from fire. Then, on him, defense, I harmony, and yes. that's more or less it. Now let's see how the party looks like minus 11, minus 12, 7, 0, minus 13, minus 8. Do not presume. You will drink the potion. I await your Do you have any other potions we should task? drink? I don't think busy. so. Okay, I'm busy. Okay. Okay. <laughs> He's nice. Uh, 19 strength. And this will give you 24, so it might be a good idea. On my honor. It shall and this should be fine. A quick save, there will be also be an auto save. Well, let's just go and witness the whole damn thing. Your Alexander. gods threaten me with arrest if I did not accompany them. I do not take kindly to threats, Gromnir. What is it you want? Here we have Malison uh, in front of Gromnir. Gromnir knows a stranger came to Saradouche. Pretty mm -hmm. Malison. Another ball spawn. You must think Gromnir too stupid not to remember. There is no way in or out of the city. <laughs> ah, to be honest, he doesn't look very intelligent. He's a half orc, of all things. You fool, Gromnir! That stranger may be our only hope of escaping this siege alive. Yes. <sighs> Gromnir knows the truth. We is no idiot. Malison has brought this outsider in to kill Gromnir. Really? Ballspawn mean nothing. Yaga sure is Ballspawn. He wants Gromnir's head too. Ha! <laughs> Foolish Malison is plotting against Gromnir. Malison is plotting the ruin of all the children of Ball. In a twisted kind of way. He looks mad, don't you think? You are mad, Gromner. Have I not always aided you and all the other balls spawn? I I brought you here to protect you. It was your paranoia that brought Yagashura upon us. 
Mad? Paranoid? <laughs> no! Gromner finally understands how Melisan lied. Melisan lured Gromner into a death trap. Tell Gromner where the Ballspawn assassin is hiding. Hiding? The stranger is not I'm hiding. I'm standing Gromner. right here. If we were not holed up in this castle, you two could have had a meeting when the stranger first arrived. Gromner will never meet hmm. with this ball spawn of yours. Ha! Really? Gromner is wise to Melisan's schemes. Melisan wants to turn ball spawn against ball spawn until all are dead. Your madness will be your death, Gromner. Nothing else. The death of you and all those who foolishly follow you. Take Melisan away. But watch closely. <laughs> Gromner knows that Melisan is tricky. Melisan lies. Melisan deceives. <laughs> oh, we'll see about that. They took her away. So the but unfortunately. Is here. Ah, good fun. Caitlin has come to kill Gromnir. Aha. Okay. That's more or less all. And we have here Elerhad. Uh, Ilkhan soldier, Verena, Elkan, and two Ilkhan battle mages, and a guy called Karuk, the Black Uninjured. And the guys with the names are Ballspawn. Now, what we should do now is. Well. Kill them. Cast spells. You guys. Hmm. So be it. Attack the mages. They are the most good things here. In the meantime, Imowen, you cast improved alac. Uh, the fuck is the name of this thing? Alacrity. Edwin, you do that too. What's a bit of luck? We won't. You might be able to deal with them, and Jahira, you deal with them here. Try to just try this one. Yeah, the injured, okay, or now the globe. Moon character casted that spell. No, fireball. You have a lactory, Edwin. That's cool. Time stop, please, Imowen. You have the. This too. Symbol stun around here. This one mage is dead. You deal with Gronir. Yes. Edwin, you cost it. That's good. That's perfect. One time stop. Our word blind from Gromir, please. Now we have to be quick. Another simple stun, let's say here. Um, Abby doesn't hurry the world thing. Won't be able to actually. Yep, yeah, here. And what else? Power word stun on Gromir 2. 1 and 2. <laughs> that was this guy, and they are. Oh, hero was stunned. What is it now? Emuen was stunned. What is my task? And character. We need to deal with this guy quickly. I want him to kill Jahira. Too, to... I want this her to be. I will send her into One the maze. Ellen Hard. What do you day. require? Need to die. That's I will do spirit. My Main characters stand somewhere around here because when Melisan we must work together to Pierce. No! I see I am too late to stop the bloodshed. You have slain Gromnir and many other bulls born as well. Ah well, how to say it? They attacked me, so. We had all the right to do it. And what that means? That means that, uh, well, we have a. We, we, we resolved one problem. Uh, Gromir gave me no choice. I never even had a chance to reason with him. I knew the chances of Gromir's joining you was slim, Kaelin, but I thought you might listen. He might listen to reason. 
I was desperate to end this siege and I was wrong, I'm sorry. Now I fear we are all doomed. There's no way out of Saradush. Between the army and the st uh, strange imprisoning magics, even our wizards are trapped here. I might be able to help Nelson, I know a way to escape the city. You can leave Saradush. Yes, of course, you found your way into the city. It is only logical to escape you to, to, um, to exact you can find your way out. Why didn't I think of that earlier? If you can leave, then the city can still be saved. They have endured so much, we must help them. Kaelin, if you can leave, then only you have the means to do that. <sighs> Why do that? I could always try to bring you and the boss pawn elsewhere. You could flee. Understand, Kaelin, that this siege is but the beginning. That's quite true. Until this threat is ended, it doesn't matter where we go. We are in danger of being exterminated by Yagashura and his allies. Eventually, even you would be overwhelmed by their power. I I know more about them, Kaelin, more than I'm saying, but I won't tell you everything unless you try to save Sardush. Okay, another one. Oh, they just love to blackmail me. Okay, so... Right. How do you know so, so much? Why do you even care about false Ponya? You might consider me to be a guardian for want, for want of a better term. I know the prophecies of Alaundo, of Alando. Uh, I know some feel they allude to the return of Baal uh, to the realms. But taking an active interest in the fate of Baal's offspring, you and those like you, I hope to prevent the Lord of Murder from returning to the realms in any form. And that means you're just another person meddling with the whole thing. And the, and the whole thing is, uh, the children of Baal will have to resolve this one way or another, between themselves. And it seems whatever these people are trying to do, be it Harpers, be it Melisand, be it whoever, doesn't work very well, does it? Since we already saw a bloodshed between children of Baal, because Immo and me, uh, and most of these guys here are also... Ball spawn. It is not my first choice to. Do, it is not my first choice to do this, Kaden. However, in my dealings with the children of Val, I have learned that sometimes the end must justify the means. Tell me what is it to be done, Madison, and I shall strive with all my power to bring it about. No, looks like I'm uh, again left with little choice in my course. Yeah, what do I do? Tell me that one. That much. The army itself is Im Im immaterial. If you found your way to Yagashur himself and defeated him, the forces would collapse. Force will collapse, but that's not a simple matter. He is a powerful fire giant to begin with. Ew, that's disgusting. I don't even want to imagine Bell mating with one of those overgrown monsters. <laughs> Alright, um, in the point, Imuen. It is any it is any more an abomination than a ball spawn elf? <laughs> she refers to me. Val was a god of pure evil. His taint is an abomination in any form. Fair enough, but the giant is no more is no more difficult to kill than any other creature. It is not that simple, Kaelin. Like you, Yagashura is one of the most powerful Balspawn to walk the realms. I don't know what gift your blood has passed on to you, but I can tell you something of his. Giants seem to be invulnerable to harm. Oh, great. Arrows, blades, even the most powerful of our spells and enchanted weapon leave no pen permanent mark. He heals faster than he can than we can wound him. How am I supposed to kill something who is immune to harm? Yagashura was not born with this immunity, he developed it, learned it somehow, during his childhood spent in a secret glade in the forest of Mir. I can show you where that glade is, but it is only speculation. The key to the giant's invulnerability might lay there, but it might not. There may be nothing there at all. Oh great, so we are on a goose chase. And if that's the case, then there is only one other place to look, though it is far more dangerous. Yagashura has attracted a large number of fanatics devoted to uh, devotees, devotees of his kind. They worship him as a god, as you can well imagine. They built a temple to him in the marching mountains. Many of them are in his army now, that may mean that the temple is vulnerable to your attack. Perhaps Yagashura's secret lies there. I don't know. Fine, I will as, uh, as accept your mission and find a way to destroy this invulnerable. 
the invincible Yagashura. I know it is much to ask of you, whether it means anything to you or not, thank you. Now I must attend to the wall's defenses, however you leave, uh, however you leave I suggest you do it as soon as possible. Godspeed, Kalen. I pray you succeed in your mission for all our sake. What is my and that much. is our course. On my ah, yeah, Jahira is imprisoned. She will jump in a moment. I hope so. What do you require? No, we. Time to move, right? You are. And yes. we have a bunch of As things we need to collect from children of Ball and from basically all the people around here. Well, maybe what that was not the best be? thing to do to send Jahira into a maze, but on my arm. What do you reconsider? Better to done? do it that way, or to lose her in a fight. I don't want that. To be honest. All right, now let's just get our stuff from here. This was a nice. This was a quick fight, to be honest. It usually takes uh, slightly bit longer to deal with those guys. That's its quarter stuff. This. Two, I think. This is what? This is a. S yeah. Could have done it that, be that better. Spear plus three, Grunt, Meister armor plus six. Uh, <clears throat> created for the Grand Meister assassin Vita Mirti, the suit will not only provides protection but also enables enable Vita to better pursue her fleeing victims. As the unfortunate wizard who fashioned this item. For the ruthless killer soon learned. Increases movement rate as boots of speed. Nice. Armor class 1. Can't be used by mages and monks. Monks. Okay. Let's see who could get that one. It's a plus 6 armor. Armor class 1. Uh, of course not. This, this one's better. Imowen, you have armor class 1. Hmm. But this will most possibly... Yeah, this limits her spell use. Which means that not ni that is not nice. This minus one. And you're using also a one that gives you minus two. Which means we... Ugh, we have no better. Okay, let's keep it for now, but I doubt we will use it. Uh, anything else here? Ah, yes, there's yes. a bunch of things still here. Gromir himself has a few things we will find very interesting. We have five of those. Let's put those here. Oh, great. Uh, the container and potion case is full. Who doesn't have those yet? You get this. It should be at least for now. Okay. As, uh, what this? This is a full plate mail plus two armor plus plus one. This is armor plus plus one, but also just the resistances. This is minus one, but fifty resistance to fire, which means we. Have no one who can actually use it well. Right? Yeah, this lowers. This is the same. This is the same. And the other ones give resistances, which means they are ten times better. Edwin, you have a high intelligence and basically you're quite good at identifying things. What do we have here? We have another Lavender Loudstone. Plus one bonus to AC, plus four to all saves versus death. Plus one to AC. Who is using um, the one giving plus one to AC? No one. Plus one bonus to Charisma, and plus one bonus to Armor Class. Um, I don't think I have anyone who can uh, who can get uh, gets more out of this. Well, basically better than this one. So let's sell this one and keep this one. Maybe something will change. This is what this is a Rana Roranach's horn 
helmet carved from the horns of great ram. Plus 50 resistance to blunt weapons. But this one we will keep because I know that this one can be improved. Uh, morning star plus 3 and ice star plus 4. 20 damage plus 20 resistance for fire. And fire resistance and plus 4 cold damage. And this is what? This is a flail or a morning star. Uh, main character is using flails, right? Flails or hammers. Morning star. Jihira, you do have a uh, club. No, it's not the proficiency we need. It's only the main character can use it. Well, quite nice. Unfortunately, the day star we have to put it away. Actually, it's not that big of a deal because we don't. The, the power of the sword is that it's very good against evil creatures and against undead because undead are evil creatures and they even get more damage. Thing is, they there will be no more undead. What is my task? Actually, oh, and these two. Right. On my honor. And now we can go upstairs and get out of here right there. Oh what fuck! Do you require? That had to hit us. That just had to hit us. Back inside, people. Okay. I I oh, protection <laughs> from weapons. I wonder why that happened. It shall be. Uh, we should be able to get out of here through the main gate now, and unlock the castle. That won't actually do much. Consider it done. Everyone, please go faster, as fast as you can, back to this place. This will allow us to. Uh, yeah, we'll will sell the best. stuff, sell things, and go I to our little pocket plane and look around there. I'm quite sure that's. Of course, we will have to. We entered this Saradush through that, um, through pocket plane, and we will leave through pocket plane. But before that will happen, I want to sell stuff and also prepare a little bit. Yeah, 200,000. That's nice when it comes to gold. Uh, should I sell any of these? Potions of invisibility, we don't need those. Oh, speed of oil speed, I don't think we will need that too. Emoen. We don't have much of... yeah, it's done much... I wonder why we don't find more scrolls. Uh, here, uh, these are our backup. Always try to keep some of those as a backup. Let's sell those. Those as well. Done. Okay. This should be quite fine. Yes. And... Here we go. First what time activating test? the pocket plane for this. Uh, let's play. Pocket plane. Always a nice place to have. Ooh. On my honor. And the final thing I want to what do here require? today yes. is speak with you. Thespinar, gladly serve the great one. Don't destroy Thespinar, anything and ooh. tell me do you have anything new for me? I look bad. The flail we you see. Not just see. Dump everything out? You like this one, maybe? Like a little snack on a tush, huh? We have Blade Singer Chainmail, okay. we already saw that one. It seems you has lots of junks in here. Needs junk drawer. Mm -hmm. uh, if I will find Circle of Netheril and Brown's Loud Stone, I can, he can create a powerful item from those I two. Hmm. Nope. Not much more, okay. Nope. I see uh, this should be fine. No more shiny ones. Oh, well. Back to cleaning, I guess. And that's more or less all we can do now. Yes. I just heal our little party. Look around here. Now we won't have use for that one. Mm hmm 
maybe this will come in handy. Maybe not, I don't know. <laughs> uh, level 4, level 5. As I said, we don't need this uh, anymore. Most of the people we fight now use magic weapons, which means we would like to have this at our disposal. And True Sight. Level 7 not yet unlocked for the main character. Uh, Imowen, you're doing fine with this uh, set, I believe. Edwin, you're also cool. What is my task? So let's go to sleep. And in the next episode, we will of course um, visit things that we have now: uh, North Forest, Forest of Mir, and the Marching Mountains. I don't know how in what order we will deal with those, but don't worry, uh, we will see that one fulfilled. Uh, and thank you for watching the episode. I uh, hope to. Uh, I hope I'm not boring, and if so, please uh, tell me about it, because I really want uh, feedback from my viewers. Have a nice day, and yeah, that's about it for today. See ya!